problem, we're going to read through the instructions, label everything, and then solve. Just break it down piece by piece. So let's read it. In the diagram below, line AB, right, this little symbol over the letters means a line, intersects DC, line DC, at point P. So let's find AB. Here's the points A and B. Connect them, that's line AB. Connect points DC, that's line DC. And then here they intersect at point, at this point right here, which they label it as point P. What is the measure of angle CPB? Angle CPB. What is that measure in the figure? So to find that angle, just look at the three letters CPB. Here's C, here's P, and there's B. So that forms this angle. And that is, in fact, a vertical angle to this one. All right, they're almost mirror images of each other, and fortunately, for our sake, vertical angles are equivalent, are equal. And I, I talk about why and, um, and prove it in another video that you can go and look at to get a better sense of what's happening here. But, um, and it's 100 degrees, right, they're equal. But basically, again, they're just mirror angles in a way. Like In other words, they reflect off of each other because these two lines are meeting at this point. And the, the vertical angles, so for example, these two angles are also equal. The angles that are across from each other. And that makes sense because if you look, if you look at this diagram, these opposite angles have to be reflections of each other. They have to be equal. And we call those reflections vertical angles. All right, so I hope that helped.